Hello and welcome back to the channel. This is the start of my uh, control playthrough. Uh, it came, obviously, it's got released today. Um, so yeah, let's get this uh, let's get this started and uh, see what see what it's about. There's no difficulty in this game, which is very interesting because uh, past remedy games have have had um, uh, difficulty based stuff in them so I'm just looking for the right I'm looking for subtitles is there any subtitles or am I blind I must be blind good idea Good idea. That's a good idea. Thank you, game. That was uh, awesome. All right, let's have it on normal size for all of that, and let's uh, let's get into this. It's brightening up a little bit. That's actually interesting that they've got the ability to to. Uh, um, to block copyrighted music, I rate that. I actually rate that. I like remedy. You've done. <laughs> That's the first thing. Good thing you've done. And this is the start. I haven't started this yet, so I'm look. I've been looking forward to this for a while since I saw saw the first trailer a few months back. So. This is going to be weirder than usual. Can't be helped. You called me. So here I am. I know I shut you out sometimes. I'm always glad to hear from you. It's just that get my hopes up so many times it's led to nothing I found nothing it's like we live in a room and there's a poster on the wall we stare at it and we think that's the whole world the room and the poster. The picture's something nice. A landscape, a famous person. Like in that movie, what is it called? The prison movie. The room's a cell, and the picture, it's different for each of us. It can be beautiful or terrible, but we're all transfixed. But it's all a lie. Something to distract us from the truth. They're lying to us. We're lying to ourselves. The room's not the world. The world is much bigger and much stranger. There's a hole hidden behind that poster that leads to the real world. We all feel safe in that room. But sometimes, sometimes, something crawls out from behind the poster. And the ones that see it happen freak out and try to forget what they saw. I'm here. Why did you bring me here? Who knows, eh? Hello? Anyone here? Hmm. No one here. Open collectibles. So what have I got? 
because it's different. There's mods for different things as well in this game, which is uh, interesting. I can't talk about that. See, I thought that, that was a ghost doll. Federal Bureau of Control. All these years I've been looking for them and they were hiding in plain sight. But aren't they always? That's what most things are these days. Most things are hiding in plain sight. Are these ghost doors or are they automatic? Why am I in the bathroom? I don't even know where I'm going. That's there's like I seem to read that there's a like about two hundred or collect Hello? Hey, excuse me. There you are. You are here about the job. Janitor's assistant. You need to go to the interview. Go that way to the elevator. Thanks. Elevator that way. Got it. Very good. I'm Ahti, the janitor, by the way. You'll work for me. You can say I sent you. If they don't hire you, later, you are no element. There be work for the axe. Take them behind the sauna. I've done enough night shift loner jobs to know it makes us come off weird. Ati the janitor is a friendly face in my book. That'll be the title. Welcome to the oldest house. Why is that in there? The cell and the poster. I was 11 years old the first time I saw behind the poster. They told me I imagined it. I've been trying to pull it down ever since. Will you help? Will I help? Doubt it. I'll have to look her up. I swear I recognise her name. Courtney Hope. I'll have to look her up for the next part. <clears throat> you there for a moment you know what's on my mind my baby brother Dylan 17 years since the men of this bureau took him
Shit, shit, shit. You want me to pick it up? The murder weapon? Really? Results of AWE's altered world events, intrusions upon the perceived reality. Now, the service weapon is, of course, a prime example of an OOP, a very powerful one. Ingrained in the Bureau's DNA, a key component in our prime candidate program. Come out of that Russian roulette a winner and you, <laughs> you're it. The same gun.
hear that? It's the dead man. Right after the pyramid spoke to me and it was just noise and I understood every word. And this gun's alive. You know what? I'm happy. Happy to be here. Things have quieted down outside. Is it safe to go? Can you turn it down, please? Is your enemy? All right, it's our enemy. That babble's contagious. It burrows in like an infuriating melody that makes you hum it over and over.
should have shot him. tried to invade me earlier. The hiss burrowing into everything in this place. Is the hiss your enemy? Alright, let's out. Isn't it? Death comes naturally in games for me. Better not be picking that up on the mic. sound that tried to invade me earlier. The hiss burrowing into everything in this place. Is the hiss your enemy? All right, it's our enemy. That babble's contagious. It burrows in like an infuriating melody that makes you hum it over and over. I might turn that down, please. Game, seriously. <laughs> like the gun is pitiful. <coughs> if that's on the mic, I need to restart this. sound that tried to invade me earlier. The hiss burrowing into everything in this place. Is the hiss your enemy? Alright, it's our enemy. That babble's contagious. It burrows in like an infuriating melody that makes you hum it over and over.
you rat! Oh, what is that? I had him cheesed there, I had him done over. And he just blasted me in the face. Oh, sucks. Sucks, 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 sucks. I mean, this is hard as it is. Because you've got no real abilities. Except the gun, and it's crap. Oh, stop dying, please. The hissing sound that tried to invade me earlier. The hiss. Burrowing into everything in this place. Is the hiss your enemy? Alright.
safe from intercom. Wasn't I just in there earlier? I can't tell you how happy I am to talk to somebody sane. The feeling's mutual. Yeah, I'm Pope, Emily Pope, I'm Dr. Darling's assistant. My turn. Should I lie? Jesse Faden. I'm just visiting. I should have lied. Mm. Oh shit! You're the new director. Hold on, we're coming out. Director, Faden. Call me Jesse. Okay, Jesse. I'm Emily. Look, somehow this hostile force, this hiss, that works. Somehow the hiss managed to infiltrate the building without any warning. And just like that, my name for it is official. The hiss. Like the sound of poison gas leaking in. We're in full lockdown. It seems to have spread everywhere and to everyone, not protected by an HRA. And, extraordinarily, you. You are the director, and that makes you special by definition. Trench is no longer the director, obviously. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm talking too much. This whole situation is just a lot. Trench is dead. Shot. Ah. I found his body. And the gun. Do I tell her it looked like a suicide? The service weapon. Also, and this can sound crazy, but he keeps appearing to me, saying things. It's hard to make out, but he told me to cleanse the control point, push the hiss out. The whole room shifted around. You did that? And you entered the building when it was already in the lockdown before you became the new director? How? I'm not ready to tell her about you yet. A janitor let me in. <laughs> I love it. This is fucking unbelievable. It's... I can't even... Ugh, look, Jesse, I have a million questions and you probably have a million more. Like, do you know my brother Dylan? Not yet. But there's something I need to ask you to do first. If you can cleanse a control point, then you can maybe cure those infected or possessed by the hiss. Because if that's possible, our options are very different. Emily Pope. I don't know her, but I like her already. Mm -hmm. She's the opposite of the faceless agency I've blamed for what happened to me for so long. But I can't trust her yet. Or rather, the bureau she's a part of. Yes. I can try. I'm speaking for you, of course. We can try it together. Okay. You with me? We did it before. Push the hiss out. Ripping it out rips them apart.
I can't cleanse them. I saw. It was worth a shot. Thank you, Director. <laughs> Jesse. I'm gonna tell her why I'm here. I'll risk it. Listen. The Bureau was involved in an... incident in my hometown, Ordinary, 17 years ago. The Bureau came in and covered the whole thing up. I've been looking for this place for a long time. That's enough. Maybe that's too much already. I can't tell her about Dylan and the rest yet. I've seen mentions of an altered world event case dealing with Ordinary. You were at Ground Zero as a child? It was one of the big ones, and before my time. And very classified. I can try to dig out some old files for you. My boss, Casper Darling, would know, but he's missing. I think he knew this was coming, or suspected. He came up with the HRAs, the Hedron Resonance Amplifiers. I think they're what saved us. Or a few of us. And Director Trench would know. Trench. The ghost, or whatever he is. He mentioned something called the hotline. Said I should find it. It's another object of power, like the gun. An old Bakelite telephone. A direct line of communication between the director and the board. Maybe he can talk to you more clearly through that. I mean, Trench has years and years of experience. He might know how to destroy the hiss. Where is the hotline? It's kept in the communications department through the mailroom. It's part of this sector, so we can access it even with the lockdown in place. We'll get the door open for you. Okay, that's my next stop. That's Tomasi's department. He's the head of communications. I don't think he had an HRA. He kind of made a point about not wearing one earlier. Keep an eye out. They call me the director. So that's not me. I'm not a director type. I'm not a leader. Why am I here? I think you already know. Yes, I came for my brother, but there are other reasons too. I said I was looking for answers, but I might never understand them. I'm not looking for proof. This is already it. More than enough. No matter what they told me all those years, I know it's real now. I didn't imagine this. I want to be a part of this world. What scares me shitless is that I finally found it. Only to see the hiss destroy it all. Don't hesitate to ask me anything you want to know. There are no stupid questions. The do oh, board of the comms department is just outside the boardroom back in the lobby. They should have gotten it open by now. I mean, I've got a lot of stupid questions, but that's just me. <laughs> she just walked in and became the director, which is actually hilarious. Um, but yeah, so far, I'm enjoying it. Even though I died about three times, but... Um, yeah, I'm enjoying it so far. Uh, it's got that it's got that quantum break vibe to it, and I've seen trailers, the trailers, clips with uh, uh, with uh, a lot of the uh, different abilities and that, and they're very quantum break esque, should we say? So yeah, that was uh, the start. Welcome to the oldest house. Um, I hope you enjoyed, and look out for more very very soon. Thank you for watching.